Alright, what is up? I played two matches, lost them both, got blown up because I suck and I'm sick of... <laughs> I may as well just start recording, fuck it, who gives a shit? Like, I really, I haven't played this in... I don't know, it's been a while since I've played it, so like, I'm really rusty, but I just, I don't care enough to warm up, I just wanna fucking play, dog. Let's just play and record, and we're gonna watch me get my ass kicked, whatever! I was hoping I was gonna run into the last dude, though, because the last dude, like, teabagged the shit out of me, and he sucked. He sucked, but I sucked more, but I know I don't suck as much as I ended up sucking, if that makes any sense. So I was hoping I would run into him again and blow him up, because now I'm kind of like, now it's kind of just like, you know, stop sitting back, stop relaxing, fucking focus, dog. Ain't gonna let nobody do that to you again. Ain't nobody gonna teabag you, homie. And, and, and I didn't, I didn't run into it, but yeah, whatever. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when teabags run wild on you? What you gonna do when teleporters run wild on you? Thank you for the special move. Shit, I suck. Thank you, cross-ups. You're a wonderful, useful system. Ha! Do it again. Ha! Oh, see, this is... You know what? Do, do you see what I mean when I say I'm fray? Because I'm fray. God damn it. Excellent. That was supposed to be a 4-2, not a fucking whatever I got. This is nice. I'm digging it. This is beautiful. I love watching slideshows. It's like I'm back in fucking watching PowerPoints and shit. Like, real talk, this is beautiful. God damn, it's still like the slideshow is stopped, but there's still a good, like, second of input delay. Wow. Yeah, now I can't even punish. Like, did you see how easy I punished that shit the first few times? I'm pressing buttons a good, like, two seconds early. No joke. Jesus, I didn't even get my jump out move in time. Why do I keep trying to punish that with a high attack? Like, obviously, it's not fucking working. Good God. <laughs> it was fine the first round. I don't know what the fuck happened. Like, I was hitting shit. Everything was going well, I was punishing, and then all of a sudden, BAM! Fuck your connection! <laughs> wow, that was truly bad. Whew! Alright, we're having a good experience so far. Get blown up by two Sub-Zeros because I don't know the matchup. Get that shit! We're loving it! Mortal Kombat! Fucking loving it! Let's talk about a game that I actually do love, Dark Souls! Damn that I get addicted to that out of fucking nowhere. I was not expecting it, but I have now run through that game like five times. It's ridiculous. And then, on my last run, I finally was to a point where, like, why am I still doing this? I have The Witcher 3 right now. Why am I not playing that? Because my last run through, I wanted to get, uh, I wanted to make an Artorias-themed build. And so, basically, you can get a weapon out of the Soul of Artorias and a shield from the Soul of Sif. Or you can get Artorias weapons from the Soul of Sif, which would require two playthroughs, and I didn't want to do that. So the decision was, I was going to get the Abyss Greatsword and the Great Shield of Artorias. Wow, was the Great Shield of Artorias was actually fucking amazing. Like, that thing absorbed every... Like, I, there was absolutely almost no stamina damage from anything. Like, I had it for the Artorias fight, and I could have legitimately just stood there, I think, and, like, gone AFK, like, completely not paid attention, and just held down block, and my stamina would have been fine for the entire fight. That's how fucking good the Great Shield of Artorias was. No complaints whatsoever about that shit. But the Abyss Greatsword was awful. Like, the stats, number one, were terrible. But then it's also supposed to get a bit of a boost uh, based upon how much humanity you have. That was also awful. Like, I had... Because up to that point, I was using the Black Knight Greatsword. Until I got to the Abyss Greatsword. The Black Knight Greatsword blew that shit up in every way imaginable damage the move sets were exactly the same except for the strong attacks and the problem the abyss swords uh strong attack stuff was so slow that it basically wasn't even worth using so it that was that was just that was some sad life stuff right there i, I was very saddened by how bad the abyss great sword was and so after that i was kind of like all right i think i'm gonna stop playing this now damn it that's an overhead you know this wow that has reach Nice combo, Nate. 
That has reach too, bitch! Eat my damage! Fuck. <laughs> that meaty would've worked, but it didn't, it didn't reach. Damn it. That's punishable. Alright, okay, okay, stop, stop. Just like, I need to stop stopping blocking. That's not a combo. Wow! Shoutouts to that move with him. That should that would have hit because they were blocking low. How the fuck no God damn it. Wow. I definitely need to stop being so passive. That's that's for sure. God fucking shit. I tried to jump, which was obviously a very bad idea. What am I doing? Oh my god, I'm so free. How did I not see that coming? Do you see how bad I am at this game? Like, number one, I'm too passive. Like, straight up, real talk, I'm too passive. This is not a game to defend. Like, if you're sitting there blocking, you're doing the wrong shit. This is a game where you press buttons, and you don't stop pressing buttons. It's so idiotic of me. And that's why I lose most of the games that I lose. It's because I'm not sitting there just hitting buttons. It's because I try to block, and this is not a game where you can block shit. This is a game where there are 11 frame overheads, and constant 50-50s, and Melina has a... I mean, not that it actually came into play there, uh, but that x-ray of hers is an overhead for some ridiculous reason. <laughs> but, yeah, so I mean, it's entirely my fault that I lost that, but it's because I am playing this like I would play Street Fighter, or like I would play Blaze Blue. Not plain wow. Ouch. I'm saying that and I'm like one in four right now in rank, so I can't really talk shit. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, pure and simple, man. I defend too much. I let people get away with bullshit like that. And it's 100% my fault. Nobody to blame for it. I can't say like, oh, this other motherfucker's hell is scrubby. This dude sucks this game. I can't say any of that. It's my own fucking fault. I'm not playing the game as it's meant to be played. But goddamn, it hurts to lose to shit like that. <laughs> it also hurts, you know, you could be like 5 and 102 by now if you didn't take so long with all this shit. I'm just saying. But now, like, I really legitimately want to face smash this guy, like, as hard as possible. Because people that do this are dumb. I'm just throwing it out there. Like, it doesn't anger me. It doesn't get under my skin, which is usually what most people try to do that shit. But it's still, like, why? I don't know if it's supposed to be a mind game. I don't know what it is. But you wasting everybody's time. Round one. And now watch me right. beat the shit out of you for it. Or I'll just drop my combos as per usual. What the fuck is that? Wake up with buttons, bitch. Wake up with buttons, bitch. I'll fuck you up for 33% damage. That actually wasn't that much. Damn, I suck at that online. You can actually, with proper timing, you can actually get up to four of those in the corner. But, uh, yeah. Fucking people in their x-rays. Fucking people in their x-rays. Every goddamn time. And I get hit by it every fucking time. I am such a scrub. Just get, just get, just fuck off. Just fuck off with your bullshit. Damn. Damn. I've gone into full-on troll mode now. I apologize. Let me just kill this dude. Oh, that missed. How sad. At least I got a win. <laughs> oh, do you know how sad this is? You understand? 
how pitiful this is. Like, I have the saddest life in the world at this moment in time. The saddest life. Whew. It's just, it's really, uh, it really sucks that, like, this game's online is as bad as it is. Not this, I mean, like, it's got, since the patch, it's gotten significantly better. I cannot hate on a uh, post-patch nearly as much as I would hate on uh, pre-patch Mortal Kombat. It's definitely fixed a lot of the issues. But it's still just... It's not optimal. In any way, shape, or form, it is not optimal. And, uh... And that's actually why, like, I really wanted to learn Reptile. I really did. And I thought Reptile would be a lot of fun. And I still think Reptile would be a lot of fun. But fuck trying to use that character in an online setting. I'm already dropping... Not really... His... This, I'll show you, because I'm I, hopefully I'm going to hit him right at the beginning. Or I'll get that instead. Uh, let me see if I can actually... Actually, no, never mind. I want to do something else. Stop blocking. But his, the one where you see me do like, you know, the shoulder press, then the uppercut thing, and then he does the other uppercut, then the shoulder press, and the uppercut again, that shit, that's actually a hard link. Nice. God fucking damn it. I press buttons. I really didn't, I'm surprised I didn't, that's kind of weird that I didn't grab him. That is apparently an overhead. This poor bastard needs to learn some combos. Fucking hell! And now his x-ray grabbed me. 100%. 100 fucking percent, people! <laughs> Shit, I suck! Please don't kill me. Jesus Christ, it almost did. That fucking run back though? That fucking run back though? Fuck your goddamn x-ray, son! But yeah, it's actually, I mean, I'm not sure if it's a one frame link, but I kind of feel like it is because most non one frame links, you can mash out, right? Like you can just hit the buttons and as long as you know it won't result in a special move or something, you can just mash it out and it'll work. And when I try to mash it out, most of the time I get it, I either don't get it at all or I get it too late, like they drop too far for the uppercut, the forward uppercut to actually hit. So it, it is a very tight link, and it's actually fairly difficult to do. Um, so I definitely can't, you know, like, say, oh, I'm dropping these hella easy combos, because that's actually a f somewhat difficult combo, but it's still just... Like, if I'm dropping that, how am, I, how am I going to land a character? How am I going to land combos with a character that has very similar uh like links throughout all of his combos like he doesn't have anything that's just one two three special like i can do with kotal Khan. all of his shit like if you want to do optimal stuff basically everything has a run cancel some kind of tight link something extremely annoyingly difficult Ow. okay this has to be punishable but i'm just i'm not getting it that's an overhead I need to remember. It's like Jason. Just block low than high. See that shit right there? I just dropped it. Okay. Too many people are free to throws. Fucking shit, cock! <laughs> you motherfuckers. 
I'm dropping everything. I'm dropping so many things. The China man is scared for the fucking. I don't know. I was going somewhere with uh, some kind of mention of you know a bull in a china shop, but I kind of lost it. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I did it! I'm the best. Heals up. He held up. God damn, dude. God damn, dude. That move is so goddamn good. The hitbox on that shit is just some silly. Ah, oh, fuck. What the hell? I threw. I threw you, motherfucker. You motherfucker. You son of a bitch. What the fuck was that? Huh? Oh. I thought that was gonna kill, and I just kind of stopped doing stuff. Yes, excellent. I'm so free. I'm so free. I just need to hit more buttons. I need to use his, uh, that move, the move that I, uh, hit him with, the down four. Yeah, his down four. I definitely need to use that move. It's actually pretty fast. It can, uh, duck under a lot of shit. So I need to use, I need to use just kind of like. I need to stop trying to punish things, really. Just plain and simple. Like, until I know this game well, which will never happen, I will never play this game well enough to, like, fucking master it. But until, like, I'm sick, because, you know, I'm sitting there thinking, that string has to be punishable. Almost everything that is a three or four hit string is punishable in this game. So I'm sitting there, you know, like, okay, surely I should be able to punish. No, no, it's, it's not, it's not working. It's just not working. And I don't, and it, so many times my inputs were just eaten because I was stuck in block stun for a lot longer than expected. So what you gonna do? Eight million, eight hundred thousand times for Kano? 25 and oh I'm sure that's legit I'm sure it is <laughs> that one might actually be legit that's a very that's a very realistic record I mean you know not to say like yo anybody with like an incredible win loss rate is you know obviously a cheater or a booster or some kind of bullshit but because I mean we've seen like the style of uh, competition that exists in this game it's not very high level like the fact that I can get wins with my shitty ass Kotalcon is really telling because I've spent no time invested in this game. It's like if we took how much time I put into Kotalcon in this game into any other character in any other fighting game, I would be getting my ass handed to me left and right, nonstop. It would just be ass beatings all around. My ass would be so black and blue, you would think you were looking into space. That's how bad it would be. And it's, <laughs> but in this game it fucking works, especially with people that like, they just, they don't bother learning combos. Like the number one thing you need to do when you go, when you try to learn a new character in this game, the number one thing, go find a character's moves that juggle. Go find what combos into a jumping neutral punch attack that causes that big ass ground bounce. Cause that's how you're going to get mo your, the majority of your highly damaging combos for most characters is going to come from that. You can do them off of Kotalkan too, but it's really tight timing. I don't like doing it because I miss it a lot, and I don't like missing. I miss enough as it is. I don't need another something that I miss often enough that it loses me a ton of damage. Um, so yeah, I just... Mm. It's just sad. Who are you kidding? You're going to Scorpion or Sub-Zero. Sub -Zero. Apparently we're going to Sub-Zero. Son of a fucking always sub -zero. the character variation in this game huge enormous non-stop matches against different people I played what like seven matches three sub zeros I guess we can notch that down into people six people half of them sub zeros oh boy Round one. we got to love it <laughs> So like, was that not punish? I have. To, I feel like that was punishable.
At least this motherfucker knows combos. Fucking shit, dude! Thank you for the meaty. Thank you for the jump attack. He got his jump attack, though. Thank you for the back dash. <laughs> Yo, online! We love it! Everything, everything happening as it should. Wow, so that has a really good hitbox, actually. Like, that has a really strong hitbox. Thank you for the fucking armor that would have gone right goddamn through that. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the neutral jump that I would have been able to punish that with. Thank you for the fucking attack coming out in goddamn time, you son of a bitch. That was not a neutral jump. It was supposed to be. Holy shit, I suck. <laughs> Holy shit, I suck. This realization is not good. I don't like it. Yeah, dude, that move's hitbox is so strong. Yes. Dude! How many buttons I gotta press? Dude! God, that move's hitbox is just incredible. That really does, like, why does it have such an incredible both vertical and horizontal hitbox? Thank you for the block. Finish him. 100%. Every single bit of that. Every single bit of that should not have happened. If just that one, if the one button press I had hit, if one button press or one block had happened that I did, that just didn't fucking happen for no good reason, I would have won that. This is why online is so frustrating. Because it's like, you know, obviously you get over it hella quickly. It's online. Who gives a shit if you win or lose? Who cares? But it's just that snap little bit of like, why the fuck? Did 17 things in a row go wrong that should not have gone wrong? Why did online eat my button presses? Why did online eat my blocks? Why? 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 <laughs> when the only thing you can think of is like, why did this happen? Not, oh, what happened there? I'm not sure. Action or, action. oh shit, that was awkward. I need to learn how to deal with that shit. But no, it's just like, there's nothing I could have done there. There is absolutely nothing. Oh God, please no. There is absolutely nothing I could have done differently in that situation. I was just... I tried to do something, and that something did not come out. Thus, we lost. And that's why online is so frustrating, especially in a game like this, where it's so suboptimal. Where you just know, like, sometimes online's gonna cost you wins, and it's just, that's what it's gonna be like. And that's never fun to deal with. Round Alright, that's a low. Why in the shit did that miss? Why did that pop up so low? What the fuck? Yo, real talk, what the hell was that? Wow. Wow, okay. Just keep jumping. Just keep moves not coming out in. What the? 
Dude. Oh, okay. The connection's gotten shit. That's why. Again. Okay. Jesus, man, this is terrible. This, this just, it got terrible. Like, look at it. You can see it slide showing. What is wrong? Like, how did we go from basically as good as you can expect? How did you go from about as good as you can expect from an online connection to, again, a slideshow? Like, it's nothing on my end. There is absolutely nothing in this house connected to the internet right now except for my PS4. So it is impossible for it to be me. And I'm assuming like there's no good reason that that person, that like that person and the person we played previously where it turned into a slideshow would want to like lag switch or anything. There, there were no signs of it in the entire first match or the first round or the first time it sh that shit happened. That's not just going to like suddenly happen and stay happening for the next like for the remainder of okay we're gonna see we're gonna find out what the fuck happens because we were fine it was perfectly what are you talking about why can we oh i wonder if it's like yo you played this person twice in a row now now you can back out without suffering a loss i suppose maybe possibly all right this might be a problem i don't know this character i know she has very strong projectiles though and strong projectiles can be a problem for Kotokan. <clears throat> Round one, fight. Yeah, like I don't know any of this character's strings. See, yeah, like I, I just I don't know all of those character strings, so I'm gonna get hit by shit like that. Oops, fuck that up. I fuck everything up. That's no way. That's safe. That can't possibly be safe. That is safe. That's apparently safe. Like, I don't know. Oh, come the fuck on! <sighs> See, this is what I'm talking about. Like, Kotokan has no answer to, like, mid screen zoning. I pressed the button, thank you for having to come out. I should never use that move. Never use Kotokan's uppercut, it's so bad. Fuck, why did I do the wrong direction? Why did I why did I press the wrong direction? I always do that. It's my own fault. Like I, that should have been the round. Oh fuck, I called the jump out, but it just didn't work. Yeah, man, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do against that projectile. Like, you would think something like that would be punishable, but it's, it's just, it isn't. What the fuck? Oh, okay. Sure thing. God fucking damn, dude! What the hell was- You motherfucker. What the- I almost lost my shit. I almost lost my shit. I'ma lose my shit in this game so often it's ridiculous. 
This dude just quit. Shout outs to you. Look at that fucking pose. I got your heart in my hand. Fuck you, bitch. You done quit. And I'm the best. Look at that. All that anger, all that anger just went to happiness. <laughs> Protect your record, dog. Oh, maybe not. Maybe that was just... Maybe the lag managed to, like, hold itself off. There was a gatekeeper somewhere along the lines of our connections that was like, yo, dog, I'ma delay this for you. I'ma delay this for... No, yeah, he did quit, but the, I guess the fatality... Uh, I suppose the fatality kind of... It just it continues regardless. So, yeah, dude, protect that win-loss record. That means fucking nothing. All right, so I think that's I think that's it. I think that's a good spot to end, and uh, I think the lesson we've all learned here is Nate is free.